ordinarily I'd delete something that's epically stupid, but when somebody rolls a barrel full of fish up to my door, who am I not to take a pot shot or two? I got a PM from a white racist whining and whinging about a video made by an equally silly black racist. Western women are, indeed, discounting the silly notion of race as a consideration in relationships. That seems very encouraging to me that your ideology might well be on the endangered species list. And it's about fucking time. It's a shame about your vastly superior white boy genes being too weak to tolerate some exposure to a more diverse palette of genetic traits. Let's see if we can clear a few things up for you about how this whole genetic superiority thing works. Genes don't really give a shit if you arbitrarily decide your genes are better. If your genes are genetically superior, then the rest of the human population can't really help but eventually share those traits. But if they aren't superior, then they won't have an advantage within the breeding population and will either linger or die out as genes that demonstrate an actual utility of being better replace them in the gene pool. Racial purity is a euphemism for inbreeding and that doesn't generally lead to a robust population. Genetic advantage isn't something that a group of religious nutters decides for themselves. The environment tests your genes, and if they are found wanting, you become redundant in terms of the further evolution of the species. So can you explain how your pure race breeding population could be getting smaller if your genes actually had utility advantage in nature? As for your girlfriend leaving, you might try being less of an asshole.